Hey guys, quick little share on this. Um, this here is a very crude, it's a LM1875 and it's taken directly from the data sheet. That's the schematic. I didn't have a 200k resistor going between 4 and 2, so I put a 220 there, but everything else is pretty much everything else is as it is there on the data sheet and just to show that it can be um, set up sort of pretty crudely let's show the music on and I've only got one channel I've already got one channel on this that actually works. I just turn it off and I turn back on it. It doesn't sound too bad. I don't have any uh, any any heat sink on there, so I'm not gonna. It's not getting warm or anything, but I'm not going to push it. Oh yeah, have a bit of this. So, just to show that. I mean, look at that. Look at a mess that is. The bloody wires all over the place. Um, I don't have actually, I don't have any music on my phone because the headphone socket's broken, it only works in mono. So I don't actually play any music from then. I've just got like a, a mono connection going in, uh, going into there onto that one meg. Uh, but as you can see, it's, it's very, very crude. It's just chucked together in that socket board. But it goes to show that, you know, you can get these things to work and work reasonably okay. Um, even if and it's not using a it's only using a single supply that so we've not got a negative voltage on there and I'm just taking that directly off here um, ten and a half volts basically and it works so if anybody out there was thinking oh I don't know about setting up one of these LM 1875s do it it's just taking me about half an hour just to chuck these together it took me longer to find the parts <laughs> um, but pretty simple um, I have actually brought all of the earths down all the grounds come down to this uh, this part here like if it was in a star ground fashion and then the uh, the positive connection just comes in there so it's 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 terribly set up but then it's not too terrible it could be worse you know I could be having um, lots of different connections for ground on this and it, it wouldn't be happy at all from what I understand um, from the other the setups that I've seen are much better in this I've had this chip for quite a while and didn't think I'd be able to set it up because it seemed a little bit too strict and complicated and it just goes to show that it does work and it doesn't I can't hear I couldn't hear any distortion on it the, the radio signal coming in through here isn't very good because you're supposed to have headphones on and look at that silly little bit of wire I've got as an aerial so I'm, I'm quite happy that it worked uh, at all without making lots of horrible noise or you know, having some sort of a um, motorboat type effect going on. Uh, anyway, but I believe that would have been down to a, a dodgy capacitor. I'm not sure completely, but that's what I've sort of got a bit of an understanding of. So, anyway, there we go. LM1875. Crude and rude, but it works. I'll do another one, I'll set one up better and, and, and do another one at some stage, but I just thought I'd have a little play with that and see if I could get it to work. And then all we're using very basic parts, like I say, you can see on the schematic if you rewind back, and, and it does work, so you can get a 
bit of instant satisfaction. Anyway, cheers for watching. Bye.